Hey guys, this is Salad Black Ops MKW bringing you another commentary, but this one is a special one because I have a very special friend with me. Introduce yourself. Hello guys, this is Reality Making. This is Reality Making. His description. Wait, what? His uh, channel link will be in the description for you to check out. And basically, we're just going to go about today and talk about a bit about a bit uh, Black Ops and Modern Warfare 3. So, would you like to get us started? All right. Um, okay. So, firstly, will you miss Black Ops? Um. Yes and no. Black Ops was my first shooter, pretty much that I'd ever played on any console. Same here. It w it was nice to play, and I just picked it up last Christmas and fell in love with it. To be honest, it's a great game. I think for the Wii, it's got fantastic graphics. To be honest, and the fact that it has to have the pointer pointed at the sensor and it still works as it does is very good. But there are still many things in Black Ops that annoy me, such as Second Chance uh, and Hit Markers. So yeah, that, that's that's your answer to that one. Uh, yeah, same here. I will miss Black Ops greatly. And, uh, you know, it's been a great game. My first shooter as well. Yeah. And my only shooter. Uh, my bought it for Christmas as well, but uh, yeah, I'll miss it. So what about Modern Warfare 3? Are, are you excited? I am very excited. The only down point at the moment for Modern Warfare 3 is that it's coming out on the 11th of November, and I was sort of hoping that I could come out with one of the first gameplays on that since I pre-ordered it, but that's not going to happen right now. But it still looks to be an amazing game. The sniper's going to be fun. Quickscoping's going to be back. We're going to get some quads in there. I'm sure every guy in Flux is going to be aiming for a few quads, not triples anymore. So that's going to be fun. And the new maps are all pretty small, so there's loads of action-packed stuff. And since this is my only shooter that I've ever played, I'm kind of looking forward to it. And even though some people have said it's Modern Warfare 2.5, I didn't play Modern Warfare 2, so that doesn't matter to me. Yeah, I call it Modern Warfare 2.5 uh, because I have played Modern Warfare 2, and uh, it has lots of it hasn't got much differences in it. Mm. You know, I mean, it's a surprise what will happen for the Wii. Yeah. You know, we're, so, we're always left out, and Treyarch don't even bother about us. Mm. Um, so, what else do you think on Modern Warfare 3? I mean, what do you think is going to be left out? From the PS3 and Xbox versions? Um, well... Yeah. I'm not really... I can't really remember much in the Xbox and PS3 versions. I haven't seen a lot of videos. But I know there's going to be theatre mode on the PS3 and Xbox, and I just don't see that happening for the Wii. I don't think it has enough power to take uh, theatre mode into its system. So, unfortunately, I don't think we'll be getting that. Oh, yeah. Um, what kill streaks do you... F I've heard of a kill streak called... Uh, it's like a nuke. Have you heard of that? Yeah. And what, the mother of all bombs thing? Yeah, that thing. <laughs> Yeah, um, I th yeah, I think it'll be in the game. I can't see any reason why not. There's been leaked footage of it, but yeah, I think it'll be in the game. It'll probably be in the Wii as well. I don't see it uh, taking up that much power on the Wii to add like something that kills every person. Because, I mean, a Rolling Thunder just goes and does that most of the time on Nuketown, so yeah, I think it'll be allowed in, yeah. Um, what, do you think there are going to be any chopper gunners in the game? I think we'll get the AC-130. I've... I'm not sure, but if we get that, that would be amazing. I think ugh, it could have been included in Black Ops, but they were sort of saving that bit of space for the DLCs, but Nintendo just wouldn't let them publish them. So mm. I think I think AC-130s could be in there, yeah. And you know about Black Ops, you know how many uh, map packs that ha we were promised, but they never came out? Yeah. Do you think that's the same history is going to be going over with the Modern Warfare 3? You know what? I think... They're not going to make any stupid decisions, and they're not going to promise any map packs for us, because uh, all the arguments with Nintendo on that, because Black Ops has been breaking Wii's, and adding DLC would just make it worse. So I don't think there will be map packs for Modern Warfare 3, there could be a few, but I'm not really sure on that. And there are going to be 16 maps on the disc anyway, which, correct me if I'm wrong, is a few more than Black Ops, so I'm not yeah, too fussed about it to be honest. Um, had your Wii ever broken down? Um, no, I've had my Wii since Christmas 2006. Uh, played Mario Kart on it for four and a half years, got Black Ops. 
and it has not broken once. It's crashed a few times, but Black Ops is going to do that to your Wii, so... Uh, no, my Wii has never broken. I've never had to get a refund or a new one at all. I've had my Wii since uh, 2008, August 2008, something like that. Yeah, mine hasn't broke at all. Yeah. And I don't see how people's Wii breaks. So obviously something wrong with it. And I think um, they should have fixed it for free. I'm not sure if they did, did they? Um, well, they did for a certain amount of time, but recently uh, Nintendo have asked for yeah. a £40 thingy, I think. Or it was $40, so it would be about £25, so not too bad. Um, you see, I'm not going to buy Modern Warfare 3 straight away. I want to see some gameplay of it. I'm, I want to see what's left out, and then I might buy it, you know, for Christmas or something like that. Well, stay tuned to my channel, and there'll be videos uploaded daily from the yeah. 11th of November. So, yeah. Okay, one more thing. Um, ha Do you have any... um? How much space do you think that's going to be kept in the Ally roster? Um, hmm. Well, in Black Ops it was 100, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, it, it can be pushed up. I think it'll be around 150, I'd say, because, to be honest, it's not that important. You're not going to find 150 people that are always online and that you want added, so I don't think it's that much of a bother, but... Yeah. yeah, you see, I, I've tried to add millions of people, you know, of YouTube. I mean, I've managed to add you and L, yeah, blah, blah, yeah, him. Yeah. And I, I've tried to add Dazran, but, you know, there was too many people. Same as Conboy. Yep. You know, it's quite... I want uh, more people, more space in the Ally roster, so it's easier to add people. And yeah, and I think... You know, more fun. Most YouTube users just add each other anyway and play with each other and record videos together and... Hopefully the Wii community can get together in Modern Warfare 3 and do some more dual commentaries and stuff like that, like this one, yay. <laughs> um, what is your best console? Wii. I've never had a PS3 or an Xbox 360 or an Xbox. The only other console I had was the PS2 and the Game Boys, so the Wii would obviously be up there. And my laptop's about to run out of battery. Oh, I see. Um, well, that's quite cool. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Um, I've played on PS3 and Xbox, but I think if you want like to compete and you know play hard, then it'll definitely be the PS3 and Xbox. But if you're just playing for fun, it'll be the Wii. Yeah, I love the Wii. So it takes more skill. I hope you guys have enjoyed this dual commentary. This has been Salad Black Ops MK Wii. Hint, hint. Hello. And Reality Making, whose friend has just come in. And yeah. we'll see you later. All right.